Hey guys, welcome to another scratch tutorial. For this one, I'll be showing you how to make a flappy bird. So what you'll need is a backdrop. Um, you can get the actual flappy bird background if you want. I've just got a blank screen and a you lose screen. You'll need a flappy bird facing straight and another one slightly tilted up for the jump. Uh, you'll need your pipe, um, a blank sprite. You can just call them sprite one if you want. That'll just go right at the end here. And another blank one. They both have to be as long as the screen. That will just be hidden, so it doesn't matter where it is. Along with the pipe, which you can just hide it, so it doesn't matter where it is. Now, um, with Flappy Bird, we need to make him show and hide on the different screens. So, back to one, which is the starting screen we need him to show, so like the game screen essentially we need him to hide on the backdrop too so now we also need to get him to start in a position so go to, now where are we going to put him, where to go just show him ok he's on an angle there, I've just got to turn him to 90 degrees so he's in the right direction. Um, I'm going to switch into costume one. So there's a good starting position. So that should be in there. Yep, it is. And that's when he shows. So now we also need to do a in this one. When flag clicked, switch to backdrop one. So when flag clicked and the game starts, it switches to backdrop one. Flag of bird teleports to there. So if it's over here. And he switches to backdrop one. He'll move there. Now what we need to do is make him go up and down. So we need a when backdrop switches to backdrop one forever. Uh, motion change y by one. So Whoop, I mean negative one. One, he probably has to fall a little bit faster than that. 2.5. Yep. Then we need another one back to switch to backdrop. One forever. If key I'll just make it space pressed. Ch um change y and I'll go 5, I'll try that out. So now, they probably need a little bit more than 5. 10, try 10. Good. Now, what else we need to do is we make need to make him change costume. So switch costume to Flappy Bird, that one. So now he's like that. Now we just need to make him change back. Switch costume to Flappy Bird. Now, this isn't going to work because he's just going to stay that one. So, what we've got to do is put this one in. We've got to put a little weight in here. I'll make it like 0 0.05. Little weight. I think that's too small. No, that's alright. We just need to make this a bit higher. I'll try maybe 30. There you go. Flappy Bird goes up and down. So he falls down if I'm not touching the space, and when I press space, he slowly climbs up. So now you can adjust just how much he falls with this one, just how much he goes up when you press space with this one. So now we need to make this pipe spawn. So we need a wind flag clicked forever. Create clone of myself. Now we need a waiting period. Now, because I want it to get faster, I'm going to create a spawn variable. It's already created here. So, we need a wait. The amount of time he waits is spawn. So how are we going to determine what spawn is? Well, we need a flag clicked forever. We'll just wait one second. We need to set spawn to hmm, how, uh, every three seconds. 
and then change spawn. So every one second, the spawn will change by 0 0.05. So gradually, oh, it needs to be negative. Gradually, it's going to spawn faster and faster. So we also need a when I start as a clone for when the pipe starts. Not forever. We need it to show because it'll be appearing. And where is it going to start? It's going to start on the edge of the screen. So at X um, motion, go to. So X will be 240. Now, Y. This determines the height of it. So for this, I'm just going to show. So the height range will be between negative 59, so we need a pick a random. So the height range will be between, so just there, negative 59 and 80. So now it will spawn there. We also need it to um, move left, so change x by negative 10. And we need it to repeat this until touching what's on this edge, the sprite 1. So repeat until touching that. And then, once it's touching that, we need to delete this clone. And I'm pretty sure that's all good. So now, I clicked. Okay, that seems a little bit too fast, so I'll just slow its speed down. It's maybe five. And I need to hide this one. Now let's try that. I just realized the problem. This is meant to be when backdrop switches to backdrop one. Just so it stops. And there you have it. Fluffy bird jumps through the pipes, but there's a little problem. Get straight to the end. We also need to get the score to work. So, this is where this one comes in. So, we want Flappy Bird to touch this one, and it'll be across the whole screen. So, essentially, what we need to do is just drag this into there, and this into there. So, now we've got these here. Just one alteration we need to make. We'll just make this guy across the screen, so we'll just make Y zero. And now I need to make it change the score. So um, then backdrop switches to backdrop one. Change score. Oh, um, um, forever. If touching pipe two, because we don't want it to touch pipe one. Change score by one, and if it's touching pipe one, so when backdrop switches to backdrop one forever, if touching this is pipe one, so the visible one, we need him to. Lose. You lose switch to the back, next screen. So how we do that is if touching then switch backdrop to backdrop 2 and we just need to come into here when backdrop switches to backdrop 2 control stop all so the whole game stops so now that's pretty much it. Um, there's Flappy Bird.
Oh, hang on. There's a problem. I just got 17 points passing through the pipe. Now that's not right. So obviously we have to do something about that. So I'll just put a weight in there. Only a little bit, just for the time that I'll be passing through the thing. So now that should be good. Hang on. Did I start with 17 points? That's also a problem. I need to change that. I just need to run here and backdrop switch to backdrop one. Set score to zero. So now, flag pressed. It's Flappy Bird. Oh, okay, I'm not very skilled at this. Oh, okay, I got two points there. Might just have to lengthen out this time. Change it to seven, maybe. There you go. There's Flappy Bird for you. I made Flappy Bird. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll put more videos like this up.